what is up boys welcome back to a brand new video and as you boys can see this is a game i've built in five minutes just using ai and now i know that sounds crazy and it actually is because this whole game is actually ai prompt generated so basically this is astro kid i'm going to leave the link down in the description so you guys can check it out i also covered this in a couple of my previous videos and it's actually pretty cool and it has expanded by a ton so basically you guys might be wondering who astro kid is for and what it's useful for well basically i use this a lot of times when i want to make a game on roblox myself and I actually want to test something first and see how it looks like with the AI generated prompt. So I basically tell it what my idea is and then I let it generate and see how the game concept is going to look like, see how the play loop is going to look like. And I believe it helps a lot. Now, that's just one of the uses that you can use Astrocade for, but it's basically for anyone who wants to delve into this AI generation type of games and see how much of a potential this has and i recommend you guys check it out so i'm going to move on to the video right now but this was just a little bit of just you know how this can be used even in roblox or any type of game that you want to make basically over the years i think we're going to have some crazy crazy things like just generating whole open world games with one prompt but this is actually so cool and i wanted to show you guys a game that i made in just five minutes by a few prompts and show you how the gameplay is how it works and how we're going to be expanding upon it which is a pretty pretty cool concept so as you guys can see this is clash arena and i'm just gonna go ahead and play again right here let me just load up the game and as you can see boom now we are in the game and we are literally a mage we literally have abilities bro look at this we have a q ability e ability and an r ability we also have base attacks and we have these cute cool orbs that you can see floating around bro this is actually so cool we have a bunch of abilities we have mobile support too as you can see we have these joysticks we have these base attacks we also have a hp and mana we have waves and we have these enemies bro look at these freeze abilities oh my goodness we even have a speed boost we have kill streaks damage boost bro there's even boosters and now we have the boss yo the boss is actually a crazy demon lord or something bro and we can even freeze him let's just throw out these projectiles bro let me see if i can m1 him bro let me see okay boom 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 yo this actually does crazy damage like that's insane bro we're literally about to five shot him that is crazy three two one let's just freeze him boom there we go we even leveled up bro oh my goodness and the waves just keep on coming in we got more damage boosts and a lot of other stuff which is pretty pretty cool bro come on like no one can even beat me we also have yeah as you can see we're literally just regening all the mana and hp waves we got a bunch of kill streaks a bunch of levels i think i could even make a prompt later down the line to just give me new skills based on each level that i get oh my goodness we also have another boss coming in bro like when do these bosses end bro i'll just let him kill me bro he does 20 damage per m1 not bad not bad bro and we're gonna end off as you can see here i'm just gonna fall right here as you guys can see we even have a menu screen so fallen warrior wave 7 level reached experience max skills and what class we were which is actually crazy now i'm gonna show you guys how i made this prompt what i did to achieve this and just basically how you guys can do the same so you basically head over to astrocade and i believe this is actually gonna be a crazy platform in the next few years because it's gonna be solely ai powered which roblox and minecraft with their kind of games are currently lacking and this is gonna be where people can just build games straight off of prompts which is very very crazy so as you guys can see uh it asked me what kind of game do i want to create same thing it's similar to chat gpt you just basically feed it chat prompts so as you can see i just told her okay make an rpg arena dungeon crawler game where i load in pick my class i can pick swordsman mage or dagger and each one has different abilities so it has slashing and base attacks and other different abilities make enemies spawn in waves and every three waves there's a boss battle with a boss health bar made the game detailed with a lot of mechanics and it literally breaks you down what the game is going to look like so clash uh, arena dive into action-packed rpg arena you can select your champion uh, battle through relentless waves of enemies uh, dynamic class-based system progressive survival and it literally gives you a mock-up uh, and it just asks you okay is this what you want before i generate it um it just basically gives a whole breakdown it even has mobile support as you guys saw or joystick you can even do edit mode right here which i'm going to be showing you guys right after this um but as i told it allowed me to pick a class boom and i just asked it to make a few changes right here remove the class action screen i wanted some random classes and then expand this gameplay and now we can even feed it another prompt which i'm going to show you guys okay 
make me another class so i'm going to ask it to make another class which is called summoner where i can summon minions with my abilities to fight for me also make another type of enemy and another type of boss now this is basically a prompt which i'm going to feed it I'm going to let it generate and I'm going to show you guys some of the results that we're going to be getting after I press enter. So let's just go ahead and let it generate. All right, boom. So as you boys can see, our prompts have finished and basically the RPG is now ready with the summoner class and also goblins, which are fast and hunt enemies down and also a new lick boss. And I also added a couple of other prompts right here just to get everything loaded, ready and be fast. So as you guys can see boom we are a mage there we go now let's just reload okay we are an assassin so this is a new class that i haven't played and basically let's see what these moves are so we have some dagger throws three daggers okay that is pretty cool q e and r same way we also got melee attacks bro that is so op i think this class might be the best one as of yet let me try to see if we can get another class boom we got mage again let's just not do that one okay well there we go swordsman bro like there's so many classes you can add bro oh my goodness we even have like throws of slashes and also base m1 attacks i think this one might be my favorite after all bro now it just took me a few prompts to generate this and also as you guys can see when i go to featured games there's a lot of games that other people have made like a pretty pretty cool stuff as you can see we even have a crypto like trading like stocks trading thing where you can like buy and sell stocks and literally profit off of it so i like bought and now i can sell and boom i like made profit which is pretty pretty cool when it's like randomized you have your own portfolio and then you have a bunch of other games they also have like you have your own games which have like had some fun experimenting and also as you guys can see they even have their own community and like about stuff you can check them out i'll leave the first link in the description if you guys are interested um but yeah other than that thank you guys so much for watching the video hope you guys liked it and hope you find this interesting it's kind of like newer content based just trying to show you guys some tools and new things like ai building games with ai that can be pretty pretty cool in the future so yeah Definitely pretty cool. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch you boys in the next one. Peace.